Now turning to Japanese baseball, the regular season winds down this week and to be followed by postseason play. Taiwanese lefty Chen Wei-in signed with the Lotte Marines just this September, but he's already looking pretty good. He, he pitched four games this regular season and helped his team make it to the playoffs. The Marines have ended the season second place in the Pacific League, and that's their best perform performance since 2007. U.S. Major League veteran Chen Wei-ying joined the Latte Marines near the end of the 2020 regular season. It was a critical period for teams aiming for the playoffs, and the pressure was monumental on the Taiwan Southpaw. But he put up a spirited display in four appearances, once a starter and once for a complete game. That puts his ERA at a superb 2.42, even though he stands at zero wins, three losses amid the Marines' offensive woes. Next up, the Marines, now second place in the Pacific League, will challenge the SoftBank Hawks in the postseason playoffs, where Chen Wei-ying is expected to appear on the pitcher's plate. As for his teammate and compatriot Chen Guan Yu, this season has been slower compared to 2019, when he tossed a career high of 44 games. This year, he's pitched for just 19, although he's still produced a respectable 3.2 ERA. Taiwanese outfielder Wang Furong of the Nippon Ham Fighters was sent down to the minors twice this season. He's played 52 games, turning in a 2.07 batting average and two home runs. That's a downgrade from his stats in rookie season. With his three-year contract to expire next year, his 2021 performance will have a decisive impact on whether he'll continue his career in Japan. On to Song Jiahao of the Rakuten Golden Eagles, who's in his fifth season in Japan. Song has pitched 38 games this year with a 1-2 win-loss record, 11 hold and a 6.94 ERA, averaging 7.18 strikeouts per nine innings to post the worst showing of his career. Zhang Yi of the Oryx Buffaloes pitched 13 games and started nine, scoring two wins, four losses and a 4.31 ERA. And Cebu Lions infielder Wu Nianting has gotten his chance to bat first in the lineup. In last Sunday's matchup against the Latte Marines, he made his moment count and opened the game with a hit. This season, Wu played a career-high 51 games and turned in a 2.27 batting average.